Hi, this is Robert Tube. Today on Colorado the Angler, we're going after the brand new legendary at Spain this week, and it's his first outing. It's Alejandro Magno, the legendary brown trout. Now, I've just spotted him. He's right in front of me. There's a guy in front of me fishing in multiplayer. I don't think he knows he's there. We know he's in this area, but I've actually just seen him come to the top of the water. Now, I'm using a popper, a size one, and I'm just twitching him. And I'm hoping he takes it. A lot of people have been catching him on the number one popper. But I've also got a bait rod with dough on a size two hook. So that's supposed to work really well. So we'll see what works and if he'll take it. But I've literally just seen him where his boat is. You might see him in the distance. He keeps coming up to the top of the water. And hopefully we'll hook him soon. But it's his first time at in Spain. He's brand new. So... If you haven't caught him before, I'm hoping this video helps you out. But I've been fishing here for about an hour. There's a lot of people in this area. I'm in a random multiplayer lobby. And uh, everyone's casting all different directions. He may be slightly different for you. Just got to look round. But you will see him uh, come up to the top of the water. This is the first time I've seen him. He's literally a few rod lamps out. So I'm just hoping he takes this lure. If he doesn't take the lure, then what we'll do is I'll just swap over to the bait rod. And we'll try and catch him on that. It will be easier to catch him on this lure rod bait casting setup because uh, it's very strong gear but uh, the float rod should be good enough as well as long as we're playing right have you been enjoying the winter event that's already started i did a video on that yesterday check that out lots to do lots of free cosmetics as well that you can go and get for the christmas holidays so check that out if you've already seen it but uh, yeah today's all about the brand new legendary alexandro um magno the legendary brown trout i don't know if you can see him but in the background look you can just see him he's just rose so he'll rise up to the surface then go back down and you just got to try and lure him and that's what i'm trying to do with this popper on the bait caster rod try and get him to take it just twitching it every now and again but uh i've had a few goes at him and he's not taking this so what i'm going to do is probably have one more cast and then we'll get out the uh, bait rod Try and get him on the dough, drop it straight on his beak and see if he has it. But yesterday, yeah, I was doing the winter event um, video and we did cover the brand new Ultimate Cruiser boats, which I'm in now. They are smaller, they are very nimble. I even had a race with a guy <laughs> in multiplayer, that was a lot of fun. Uh, I've been trying to do it for the last few days, actually, uh, since the content's been available. But it's just finding the right person and this guy actually just pulled up and it's like, let's go. <laughs> We had a little race with them, so that was fun. Uh, I did drop a link in the video description to the new three DLCs as well, because quite a lot of DLCs have just come out. Some are free, some you have to pay for. So check that uh, video out if you've already seen it. The link's in the video description to see what you can get. But yeah, there's quite a few new DLC contents just come out. So it's very busy on Colorado the Angler. Right, we've swapped over to the bait rod. Let's see how he does with this. He's at the top of the surface, so... We've got him uh, ready to bite. Come on. I want to get him and just hook him and let's go. Let's go. Here he is. He's coming. <laughs> Come on, take the bait. Interesting to see how he fights. We caught the legendary Kamitsu Barber last week. That was an amazing fight. A lot of fun. Check that video out if you haven't already seen it. I gave little tips on how to get him, where the location. Um, some of his traits, like with the legendary Kamitsu Barbel, it makes like a gurgling noise, so you can locate him by the sand, which is very useful. But I've not heard anything with Alejandro, um, the legendary brown trout, so I don't know if what his is yet. Um, I'm sure we'll discover that as we fish with more. But uh, I've just spotted him after, like I say, about an hour just trying in this area, and then I spotted him near that guy's boat, and I was like, ooh, look at that. So, hopefully we'll get him in soon. How's your fishing been going this week on Colorado the Angler? Is it any diamonds, any legendaries you really want to get? Like I say, it's a new rotation this week. Started today. So, you've got a week at least to catch whatever you want to catch legendary-wise. So, there's quite a few in rotation. This is the first one I'm going after because he's brand new at Spain. Never caught him before. So, it'll be our first look at Alejandro. Alejandro... Got to say it right. <laughs> I think it actually means Alex in English. Um, so that would be a lot easier to say. <laughs> but yeah, Alejandro, uh, the legendary Brad Trout. 
he's fighting well. I put him, he's sort of similar sort of power wise, fight wise as the legendary Kamitsu Barbell that I caught last week. But yeah, he's putting up a good fight. He's staying at the sort of same distance. When you fight a legendary or diamonds and things like that for different species, you get a sort of like a trait and your feel for how they fight and how fast you should reel in, how fast you should drop the rod, get it back up, pump the rod. Um, it's all very important. And once you sort of dial that in, then you, you start getting the line in. Uh, well, you hopefully can get, get the line in. Sometimes the legendaries especially uh, can get a second wind and you just think you beat them and then bang, they're off again. And sometimes you actually lose them like that. I have lost a couple of legendaries like that myself. So it can happen. So it's not always you just hook them and you're definitely going to get them in. Uh, it's just a lot of it is down to how you play the fish. When I used to fish with brown trout, we had a lot of uh, streams near me. Uh, some like in like towns, cities and even uh, little brooks and things. Uh, bridges and you would just cast hand lines to them with worms and leisures and uh, it's quite fun as a kid catching like I say you catch quite a few brown trout and catch the odd rainbow there but it was surprising in some of these inner city areas where you would actually catch these brown trout There's some really nice areas near me as well which like in Derbyshire and things like that where they're absolutely beautiful scenic very expensive rivers to fish on as well where you can get the trout and things like grayling and stuff like that um, but some of these inner city places were, were really interesting where you'd like you not get nothing in there It'd be like a small tiny stream um, Sometimes pollution rubbish and whatever and then you just see like a massive brown trap <laughs> like, Where's that come from? You wouldn't think it lived there, but uh, it's interesting as a kid fishing for them. That's what I'd tell you that I Have been fly fishing for trout as well, and that was quite fun um, Not the easiest thing either but I'd love that added to Colorado the Angler. He's very popular, actually. Um, I just wonder how complicated the casting would be um, to get sort of accurate. But if they could nail that, I think that'd be amazing, especially on the rivers, if you could, like, trot, float, or fly. And, do you know what I mean? I think if they could get that right, I think that could be a very popular technique. It is requested quite a lot as well. So we're starting to win the battle now on Alejandro. The legendary brown trout. I can't wait to see him. Come on. I've got all my Christmas gear on. Like I say, the winter event is on till January. Um, so go claim all those items. You just buy them with in-game gold. You just go to Sophie's Tackle Shop. Go in there. Go to the souvenir section and you'll see all their Christmas gear. You can buy them. And there's a lot of selection of items. There we go. We have got our first legendary brown trout. Alejandro Magno, legendary brown trout, there you go, so he looks beautiful, brown trout are very spectacular looking, um, they are stunning, and he looks good as well, so there you go, let's take a few pictures, now I might be a minute just doing this, but this is going to be the thumbnail, but look at him, they've really nailed that, they are normally sort of, well it depends on the water as well, can affect how they look, but they're normally like a brown, bronzy gold with like little red eyes, uh, as the sort of spots on them, but yeah, they've done well there. I wouldn't mind catching a brown trout that big. You wouldn't need to catch another one for a while. But yeah, now we've caught him, so that's his score, his details. What we'll do is, we'll go over the rod details for both setups, so you can catch him on either of these setups. We'll also go over the location. The location will make you laugh because there's like so many people just all on this one spot uh, fishing either side. But multiplayer is fun and it also lets you know you that you're in the sort of right area because you'll have numerous people, as you can see, uh, just on this spot. Right, let's go over where we are. So location for this week's legendary brown trout, Alexandro Magno, is top right corner. So this is where you start, so diagonal top right corner in this sort of cove. Now you have to come from the very top. Yeah, so once you've got your boat from this outpost all the way down to the docks, get in your boat and you have to drive quite a long way down to this cove where everybody is, as you can see. Now you'd be where the dark sort of water is, the deep water, right on the edge of it here on the left side, that's where most of us are as you can see. But uh, it can be slightly different for each person. But you've just seen where I caught him. Right, on to Rod's setups. Let's have a look. 
so this is for the laws this is what i was using and the popper number two a lot of people seem to be catching it on this i was trying as you were seeing uh, it wasn't taking it for me make sure you twitch it just flick your rod every now and again and you should take it and this is the my bait rod setup which we've just actually caught him on um number two hook and we caught him on bread dough so there's all the details for catching alexandro the legendary brown trap i hope that helps you out i'm ron mcchew we've been playing call of wild the angler catching the legendary brown trap for the first time at spain having a lot of fun hope you enjoyed the video please subscribe to my youtube channels and thanks for watching bye bye